Hi everybody, I'm Wilson, representing Federal Components. I'm back again. Um, hope everybody is safe during these COVID times. Today we're going to talk about basic model installation tester, tester 3165 that can measure up to 500 volt AC. Okay, I'm going to open up this installation tester and show you what's inside the last video i did not mention about the warranty just to highlight again all kirizu installation tester come with one year manufacturer defect warranty if you can see from here okay i have opened up this box if you can see it uh, there's test leads uh, installation analog installation tester and you have uh, this casing and the strap with the user manual, certificate of conformity, and four batteries. Just a few advice that I highlight last time. All insulation tester are not allowed to test on light circuit. If you can see from this symbol, okay, you are not allowed to test live circuit because you damage the equipment. See here. Without further ado, I would like to show you some of the basic testing of the insulation tester. Uh, this will be a very short video. As for my last video, I was going to use the same test leads. Um, so I'm going to test it. It comes with the red color uh, test lead with the crocodile clip and another with the green color. Green color is actually uh, it's for the earth socket. Okay, I'm going to plug this into the live line circuit. And, and for the earth circuit, I'm going to plug on the earth socket. As you can see from here. Before uh, I um, show you the testing I like to show you some of the basic thing over here if you can see from here there's this battery check okay so battery check uh, once you uh, put in your batteries you can actually press this and there will be a blinking light here so this will show that the battery is very powerful in any case when there's blinking light is becoming slower and slower that means showing that your battery is getting weaker and weaker. As for the last video, I've shown you that no live circuit. I'm going to show you this model. Uh, it's not like not like the other model. We will give you warning, okay? But if you plug in this model, uh, there will be no warning, okay? If you can see, I already plug in the two crocodile clip that shows 240 volt you can see from here my meter actually shows 240 volts okay, but there's no warning so just be careful so I, I have off this power and what I will do is I'm going to test the resistance so you can see the power is already off there's no live circuit so I can actually begin by pressing the button currently i'm doing one man show so I actually hold the orange button and you can see from here is actually no live circuit and i measure up to i think about 500 about 400 something back home okay okay beside measuring the socket resistance i sometimes i just want to show you i have this see here 100 mag resistor okay so I'm going to test this 100 mag resistors this is the same thing I will do because I'm doing one man show I need to hold this button here so 100 mag resistor and I have this value 100 mag
So basically for this model 3165 in the market, there's also another model 3166. The difference between these two models because 3166 measures up to 1000 volt uh, and 3165 measures up to 500 volts. So it's between 1000 mega ohm and 2000 mega ohm. So basically other thing will be the same. Okay, and we also have this, uh, and one more thing, there's this movement zero, this is to zero, doing, you, uh, you can actually zero it before you measure, it will be much more accurate. Okay, so today, will be, that's it for today, uh, if you uh, um, like my video, uh, you can actually subscribe my video, uh, so that I will publish more videos. Uh, meters installation videos next time uh, to share with all my end users and customer thank you